I had no idea there was blue jello. Yeah. Hi, Sobey. Thank you. I was muted. I wasn't. I had no idea there was blue jello. That's going to be my answer from now on. I liked orange, though. Orange is also good. I like orange. Oh, no. I don't want to play Dark Souls. Confirm. You were just doing that. I know. I lost so badly. Oh, I was watching. Nobody wanted to hang out with me or talk to me. So yeah. What are you doing over there? Don't get over there. What do you what do you mean? I thought VC was closed. VC was closed. I was making a joke. No, oh, I was like, why are you bitching? Jello's greater than pudding? Eh. I don't know about that, it depends. Yeah. Homemade pudding? Oh, beach jello any day. It's so good. It's creamier. It's softer. It's just oh, it's per it's perfect. I've only had homemade bread. I'm trying to figure out how to change the screen. That's a personal problem. It's not personal. I think it is. Nope, not personal. Yeah. I'm so sorry I am late to a stream, by the way. I was busy. And dinner was late. Because I had to put dinner in the oven at 3.30. I put it in at 3.46. And I was like, oh, Alistair, you asshole. <gasps> it's fine. I hope I figured it everything. It was not delicious. Dinner? Yes. Why not? I don't really like manicotti. The hell's manicotti? It's like pasta. It's like, have you ever had stuffed shells where they like put cheese inside of it? Nope. No. Well, then I don't know how to explain it to you then. It's like pasta with like cheese stuffed inside of it. But it's like mm -hmm. dry ass cheese. It's not like gooey cheese. Mm -hmm. It's like mozzarella. Well, no. Yeah, wait. Regardless, I hated dinner. There you go. Regardless, I hated dinner. I've barely eaten all day, and I'm just like, I'm not hungry today. I don't know what it is. Okay. I'm gonna die. We're all gonna die. My body's gonna just eat it. Oh, well, no, that already happened. Um. Top three cheeses: Pepper Jack, Colby, Swiss or Poodle. That's first of all, it's four. Second of all, I hate Swiss. You hate Poodle Swiss? Is great. Were you asking me if I hate Swiss? Yes, I hate Swiss. Why? I don't know. You can. You, you can ask me one day long, I don't know. There's a lot of lizards over here, Jesus Christ. What are y'all doing? I'm enjoying it. I have, my, I have three screens hooked up now. Oh my god. Mm hmm. What's so now I can. Now I can watch you look at read uh, Discord and play games at the same time. So, so what's your your favorite cheese, Pixel? Mmm, that's a good question. Yeah, I know it is. Maybe Monterey. Cheddar's good. Medium I, cheddar. I like a lot of cheeses. I just, I just don't like. I like shredded cheese. Oh my god, yes. You just eat a whole bag of that. Oh my god, I know. I wake up in the middle of the night and I go upstairs and I just shove my face full of it. That's like the fattest thing I've ever heard. Thank you. You're welcome. My recovering eating disorder thanks you as well. You're welcome. <laughs> My sound is dropping. Mine too. I think it's because it's gonna be nighttime. 
Just gonna pick flowers. Willow. Yeah, you're Willow. I forget. I forgot. We only just played last night and I, I forgot already. I didn't even know I had a character already. Oh, uh, well, okay. At least I'm not the only one, then. Because I logged yeah. on and I saw Weber's face and I was like, what am Weber? What? How? Oh. What is Ooh, this why? foolery? What is this tomfoolery? What are these shenanigans? My Uncle Tom called me today and then I texted him and I asked him what he needed and he's like, nothing. I was like, okay. My niece broke her arm today. Which one? The oldest one? That's not what I meant. But okay. I don't know which arm. I don't know. I thought maybe you would know. Now I got a phone call saying that she broke her arm today. I feel bad for you. I don't. Yeah, I don't either. I just want to her. sound sympathetic. It's good for her. It's good. Says the one who's never broken a bone in their life. <laughs> never. Never broken a bone in my life. That's because I was always so extra cautious because of being disabled. I'm like, I don't want to die. Like, I've gotten injured, I've just never broken anything. Like, I've been in casts, but I've never broken anything. I wanted to die, and that's why I did a bunch of dumb shit and hurt myself a lot, but I've never broken well, anything. Broken I, I wasn't gonna go that dark, but same. Oh, you said your sanity's down? Mmm, it's at 82. I'll feed you with a baby. Did that help? A little bit. Oh god, there's frogs. Frogs gay. Turn into fucking frogs gay. I need to make a razor to shave my beard. Which is full of webs. Oh, what do I need for that? Oh, I need two twigs. I only have one twig. How dare I? How dare you? your day. That's alright. Starting to feel a little better. I'm glad. You sound better. Yeah. I'm not as medicated as I was yesterday. Well, that's good. Yesterday I was just fucking out of it. Yeah, I know. I was there. I was. Uh, I know that as well. Oh, my axe broke. <laughs> no. My table. It's broken. I assumed you did. <laughs> Don't assume shit. It was I'll assume whatever I want. It was strenuous emotionally, but other than that, it was fine. Hey, I found the queen bee. Good. So many flowers here. Dead guy. And a shovel. And locks. 
So many locks. And creeps. So many creeps. So I've been in a slasher movie type mood lately. Yeah. Not tonight. Well, no. Someone needs to sleep, obviously. What? What do you mean? I mean, you know, don't want the baby to get scared. What? It's so confused. Good. To me, I said not today because you wanted to watch The Matrix again. I was referring to you. Hounding, you've been me to, to well, if you don't, if you don't want to watch movies with me, it's okay. I'll stop. No, I'll do it. no, no, it's a, no, no, okay, no, fine. no, no. You, 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 okay? We won't do it then. Oh my God. He loves me anyway. Hey, I found piggies. Oh, good for you. Are you mad? I'm not. I just said good for you. You're so mad. Oh my god. You're like an overly sensitive girlfriend. You're like an overly sensitive... sad person. <laughs> Fair. I am. I died. Do we have a touchstone in this one? Mm, not that I found. I don't think so. I was trying to get this, uh... There's a... A chest here? Oh, yeah, no, I, that's happened to me before. Okay, I'll die with you. It's only fair. It's not fair. Fine, I'll live forever, then. No, no, I see how it is. You, you don't want to play with me. You don't want to watch movies with me. I'll like just I, go. Like it's I okay. Said. I'll go. I'll go. It's okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. You left the game and everything. Well, okay then. <laughs> He's joining back in. I was literally gonna change the game because he left. Welcome back. Shut your security mouth. Come on, Labouche. Hey, I got a pufflet. What? It's like a bird with duck feet. A pelican nose or something. That sounds... amazing. It's like Toucan Sam, but like as a chibi. Oh my god, that actually sounds adorable now that you said that. I'll take a photo and I'll send it to you. Also, you're lucky I came back. I heard you. No, no, I was waiting. I was going to change the game. I was going to. Yeah, exactly. I was very close. I just didn't think you were going to come back. Yeah, you didn't want me back. It's, that's what no, you mean. I did. I just know that you get into mood sometimes, and I wasn't gonna force you. No, no. I see how it is. What are you eating? Chocolate. Oh my god, that puffin is cute. Told you. He's adorable. Wish I was cute and adorable, and people loved me. Me too. <laughs> oh wow, I feel so rejected. Not you, me. No, you're the one who's rejecting me. It's just all like, oh, I wish I was too. Like, okay, I'll just go over here and fuck myself then. <gasps> Hi, 
Hi, Scarlet. Fembe, what are you talking about? Why do you do this to me? I love how I'm just ignored. What? Did you? What? I'm lost. <laughs> I was talking, and then it's just completely ignored. Oh no, I'm sorry. I noticed Scarlet in the chat. I didn't want her to feel left out. Yeah, it's me. I have a little trouble with that random. Leave me out, why don't you? I get it. I mean... You know, I'm getting this close to just leaving, right? <laughs> Okay, I'm being ignored now. No, you're not! What if we're twins again? Can we commit if we're twins again? Please, I was gonna say I'll leave. Why? Because I don't wanna be Wobby, plus I'm being ignored. Oh my goodness. That's what I'm saying, if we're twins again, can we commit? Because I know you hate this character. Although I quite like him. And I'm, still, and I'm still being ignored. What do you mean you're being ignored? What do you mean? I'm so confused. Can you not hear me? Can you not hear me? I was just talking about how I was being ignored for this I, longest and time. Then I, but, but I was talking to you. I wasn't ignoring I you. I said it like six times and you kept but brushing was, me off. Well what, well, what do you want me to say? I wasn't ignoring you. That's why I was keeping the conversation no, no. going. No, you just kept moving the conversation to other things. Oh my goodness. What do you need, Pixel? What someone can I do like, for you? Someone, someone who genuinely cares about me. I do. That's why I don't know why. I don't, I don't, I don't see it. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. No. No, you're not. I am. I mean, what are you sorry about, though? I'm sorry about making you feel bad. Bad it's, about what? Other than that, I don't know what I did. I'm confused. Yeah, exactly. You're just ignoring me. You bitch, I have poor memory. Excuse. Oh my god. Why do you do this to me? Why? <laughs> Why are you picking on me and then completely forgetting about it and then just making me the bad guy? Was I? Yeah? I don't remember. Exactly. Oh my god. Okay, I'll just leave it. No, I'm beat. Okay, if you want me to leave then. No, I, I saw it that you joined the game. I thought it said you left. I don't know if I should leave or not. I don't know either. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Clearly, clearly you don't want me here then. What? No. Okay. Goodbye. That's... Bye. I'm not saying it. I mean, I don't know what to do now. I don't know if I should actually change the game now. I'm so confused. Pixel! <laughs> Why? Oh, I'm too tired for this. Okay, I guess I'll change the game then. I'm sorry you feel bad. I still don't know what I did, but... Okay. Sorry. Feel better. <laughs> Putting it on this screen so y'all don't see. My personal information. Um, Okie dokie.
Hopefully that loads. Wrong screen, there we go. Ah, oh, big stretch. Uh, I believe we're on this one. It's not full screen for some reason. Here we go. Oh, I did it. I think it just hasn't loaded for some reason. Thank you, though. I'm good-ish, I guess. How are you? I'm good-ish too. Well, that's good. It's actually been a while, Helio. I'm glad to have you here. Wait, did my, did my stream... Oh, 17th. 
just gonna put seeds down. I don't think they're gonna last for the 11 days. I have no idea actually how far I am. It's been a while. Okay, community center is open. Oh yeah, this is remixed. Oh Jesus Christ. Hi, man guy. Oh, jeez. I forgot this was remixed. It's been a long time. Oh, so it looks like I'm pretty good for the whole well, except for the quality ones to do that. But yeah, it seems like I'm on point for everything, so that's dandy. Oh, <gasps> B, thank you so much for the hydrate! Sorry, I was messaging my mama. Because for those of you in, in America, it is Mama's Day. Oh, are you jumpy? Oh my god, a dad joke! And, um, I don't have any more thrown cookies for Odin. So we'll probably go to his regular ones. But I will put one aside for him. Thank you very much. Okay, dad jokes. Jokes. Sorry, I lost it in the middle of. Okay, I'm not gonna say that one. That one's too dark. <laughs> okay, I like this one. Um, what kind of doctor is Dr. Pepper? easy right now. What do you mean 
an herbalist. I said physician. You know, fizz. Fizz. Physician. Funny stuff. Well, probably, yeah. Oh, wait, my water can't inside. Dead, but we'll water it because I'm not sure. But yeah, how have you been, Jumbie? How's Fester? out there if they deserve it some mamas don't <laughs> but that's okay I'm doing okay I'm alive at least and that's all we can ask for I went to visit my grandmother's grave today so that's always yeah, kind of rough. To be honest, today's usually kind of rough. Yeah, I feel that. Like, my mom's okay. My mom is fine, but my grandma was a big part of my life. I only have one grandmama left, and she is a gem. My friends are gonna let me join VC with them. I'm okay. I'm waiting for everyone to agree. 
I don't want it to be just, you know, one or two people. Okie dokie. Hi, Hello. baby! Friends! Hi! <laughs> You, oh, you're turning on your Esther. camera by accident, sweetie. Is it an accident, though? <gasps> well, it's Is not going it to work if your model's got your camera going. Let me try. <laughs> That's okay. I can still see you on stream. I'll just see your reaction like three minutes from now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not three minutes. Excellent. I don't know. Am I lagging? Here, shake uh, your head back and forth really fast. Four. It Four didn't or five really. seconds. But that's okay. I got I got that you <laughs> Hi. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring you guys on screen so everybody can see your beautiful faces. So OMG, yay. it's the king. Also, hi Jemby! Hi Jemby. Jambos. I always call you tyrant in my head and when I see you on Twitter. I just call him by the end. I call him by the end of his name because that's what mom does. Oh yeah, yeah. Hey. That's where I picked it up from. Anyway, I'm okay. I slept for 18 hours. Yeah. Yeah. My, my husband here had to call me because he was like, are you okay? Yeah, no. I wasn't really worried, to be honest, because I had a feeling you were just sleeping. But then other people yeah. were messaging me and I was like, maybe I should check on her. I was very worried. <laughs> I was like, hey, what's up? Check in, what's up? <laughs> I had like three or four people asking me like how she was, and I was like, you know what? Maybe I should just make sure. Yeah, I mean, I did sleep 18 fucking hours. I mean, but I just so understand I feel much what's going on. Ooh, I wonder if I can actually, like, <laughs> I'm gonna see if it would even let me log into my... So you're Oh my god, yes! They removed, <laughs> they removed my login credentials for work already. Ah! Damn! That was quick. Yep, my account has been disabled. <laughs> I mean, Swag. Kind of kind of yeah. kind of fucked. Yeah. I mean, yeah, but it means that I can remove all the fucking. <gasps> Wait, can I? <gasps> yeah, I can't. I can't view anything anymore. That's partially why I was asking you about like unemployment as an option. Because no, no. Okay, so I first of all, I tried signing up for it last year when they were cutting my hours and did not qualify, which means that I can't apply for another year and potentially qualify because they still have the wages in from that period. A. B. Um, I still would not have made enough money in this last year to um, qualify for unemployment. Honestly, only people who made like a substantial amount of money will really qualify for unemployment. It's absolute bullshit. Um, you have to work your ass off in order to qualify for unemployment and then work your ass off while you're on unemployment just to keep it. It's absolutely bullshit. One, two, they would expect me to put in job applications. I cannot do that because if I were to put in job applications and potentially get a job, there would be an issue with the fact that I'm coming to visit you in like a little under a month now. And then once I get back, there's only going to be a couple weeks I'm here before I have to have a month off again to move home and set up my um, office space. It makes me so excited when you guys get to see each other. <laughs> it makes me really excited too. Because like me and Bastard were separated for like a year or so. And like, when I first saw him, I died. It was on Thanksgiving. It was like two days before Thanksgiving, actually, because it was Fredsgiving. God, that fucking thing. <laughs> I just jumped on you. Jesus. Oh my God. 
Lena is the only person I've ever been excited to, like, pick up from somewhere. Hey, oh. yo. That's just because I haven't come visit you yet. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, oh my god, yes! We need to do that! We need to do that! Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. That's now- I'm going to obsess over that now. Hell yes. I would love to come hang out with you guys, but I'm not dying of whatever I'm dying of. I mean, I'm getting better, so... And also, when I'm not poor. A hell of a lot faster than I am. <laughs> yeah, he's been sick for like, a week and a half yeah. now. Oh, I know. Well, you can actually rest. I feel like Bastard's family makes him do everything. Yeah. And also, does it help that... What? Bastard's on testosterone, so I'm oh. sure that's probably also affecting his throat, because he's been doing a lot better energy-wise, but just not, like, throat-wise. Well, I'm sorry, I asked you just, like, cut out really bad after that. I had to well, ask. Well, yeah, I actually saw what happened. They muted their mic and leaned over to ask Bastard if it was okay to say that on stream. Regardless, I feel bad. They so I know, it's so sad. Imagine what it's gonna sound like for you, baby. Your voice is gonna shoot down into hell. Oh my god. <laughs> You're gonna in sound the, like the in next reality, you might corner. die. <laughs> Your voice won't get any lower. Just <laughs> just get... away from say, Corpse 2 Electric Boogaloo. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. And for basically the same reason, too. <laughs> Oh my god, that's I mean, fucking hilarious. Uh, I mean, the one you, good part about to... being sick is that um, it lowers my octaves by like 12, which is cool. For you, for me, it's like. <laughs> Wait, hold on, I gotta like... ask Am I the only cis person in this call right now? Uh. Yes. <laughs> yes! LGBTQ just taking over the world. Yes! I'm here for it. <laughs> I mean, you're not straight, so that's something. Yeah! True. Scarlet says <laughs> hi, Lena. Hi, Scarlet! Hi, Scarlet. I don't think Scarlet was here for me changing streams. Damn, Scarlet didn't even tell me hi. Scar I'm even like, damn. Damn. Like, uh, Scarlet, say hi to everybody else, too. Yeah, even bastard, even though you can't say bastard on Twitch anymore. Or you can't call someone a bastard on Twitch anymore. Does username Maybe Twitch we just. <laughs> oh, you have a question for me. Okay, yeah, ask your question. Ask the question. Ask and you shall receive. I'm just gonna leave my mic unmuted, but just so you guys know, I'm typing an essay. <laughs> oh wow, the latency for Scarlet must be really bad. <laughs> no, I don't want to. I'm. I'm sorry. Oh hey, um, you're now Bass. Apparently, why don't why don't we just call him Boss? <laughs> what? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Lad got me guilt you. <laughs> I'm so sad. I'm like, no. You were referred to as Bass, and I was like, you know what? You change <gasps> one letter in there, and he's boss. Let's do that then. Oh. Dude, I swear to God. I'm gonna be out here. Oh, fucking salmon. <laughs> Why are you fucking salmon? Why would I fuck salmon? Stop. <laughs> What the fuck, darling? What? <laughs> oh. They said bass, which is a type of fish. fish. So I was like, a uh, bass dumb. I would be a salmon. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, they are the superior fish. I mean, agreed. 
I oh my god, I watched a salmon die the other Does day. Does Al ever send you really weird crap? Do you mean like gifts or do you mean like gifts? Because yes. I've given you a weird gift. What did I give you? That's weird. I feel like there was at some point where you sent me a stuffed animal, and the stuffed animal was not the weird gift, but attached to said stuffed animal, you gave me like a picture of a. Uh, of something weird. I don't remember what it was. And you'd actually like attached it to the stuffed animal and I was just like the fuck? I'm very confused. I don't remember. That might have been a fever dream. It could have been. Because I have no idea what you're talking about. YouTube videos? I feel like it. But I'm usually the one sending him weird shit though. <laughs> we send each other weird TikToks too. Like... Yes! Okay, weird TikToks. Okay, that counts. Yeah. He does send me weird shit. Just, they're TikToks. Yeah, we send each other so many TikToks. Yeah, I'm yeah. usually the the one who sends the weird stuff, though. Because like, I'll see something and I'll be like, ooh, funny. You have like 60 TikToks to look at from last night because I couldn't sleep. Yeah, and then I slept 18 hours. That's fine. I'm sorry, I'm going to keep repeating it because I'm just like, what the fuck? Well, Y'all can sleep. DM me whatever you want when you can't sleep because the only thing that I'll do if I am asleep is not respond. Like, I'm so good at putting my phone on silent, you don't even know. I always have my computer on do not disturb, but I always have- I have my phone- I got like an iPhone, and it's got like the personal mode, and it's like from when I leave this location, which is hilarious, because I am agoraphobic. I fucking never leave this location. <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. Itch. Speaking of weird gifts, shout out to that, um, that bulb of rice. Do you remember that? Uh... Oh, yeah. Oh! Yeah! Shit! That was fucking weird to try hard. No, that was like... That was like... Dude, I loved all of those weird little... Like, you, you made that jar of stars. Okay, so he like hand-folded little origa origami stars and put them all into a jar. And there was like, how many were there? Do you remember how many grains of rice there were? No, but I do remember that I counted them all. And there was like 700 and something, and it was- wasn't it like, how- how many days left until I turned 18? Because I was like, really suicidal, I really wanted to move out. And I was like, literally like, I'm like, I'm never gonna make it, I'm never gonna make it. And he was like, look, and he like, counted out. And he, like, put them in a little glass jar, and sealed it up, and wrapped it in, uh, it was, like, blue yarn. And he gave it to me, and he was like, you can hold the days you have left in your hand. And it made me feel really, really good, and I liked it a lot. It was so That's fucking so sweet. That's so cute! That's so cute! It was so cute. I had that- I had that little jar for so long, I don't even know what happened to it. It probably happened- it- I know it didn't move with us. Probably. It's probably in a box somewhere. Oh! If we still have it. I'm gonna put that in a memory box. box. If, if we still have the little it jar of- Turn it into a, like a Christmas tree ornament or something. Yes, oh my god, that would be- It's like the perfect size for a Christmas tree ornament too. And it's like glass and everything. It was stupid cute. It was like wholesome as fuck. That's adorable. Yeah. I'm it was kind, kind of, of dry hard healthy, though. Because, um... Oh, come on. It's the beautifulest try-hard gift ever. Um, so when I was working in Hot Topic, I actually was wearing a necklace that I told a friend I would never take off because she and I made it at Warp Tour. And while I was working, the thing broke because the way it was set up was it was hanging on by the lid of this tiny-ass jar. And the lid just sort of fell out because gravity. And so the jar itself fell on the floor and just shattered. No. Are you still friends with that person? Eh. Okay. Yeah, that's I, why. I just, it was a I spell suppose. and y'all broke it. 
<laughs> no, okay, here's the thing. I'll explain the, the reaction. So we were sort of friends, but we were friends in the sense that she was a small time musician and I'd go to every single one of her shows that I could. And, you know, like I was supportive. So I guess she probably saw me as just a fan. I saw her as a friend. <laughs> and I actually texted her and I was just like, yep, it broke. And she was like, no. But then we haven't really spoken very much since she, no. she became verified on Twitter. No! Damn. The fame's got people blind. I'm sorry. Well, no, she just has a lot of people to interact with now, and I was not ever really somebody that she was entirely close with. So, like, it's chill. I occasionally comment on her TikToks, but I don't think she realizes that it's me. I don't even know if she remembers me at this point. Honestly, I hate the fishing mini game. It makes me kind of sad because like she's so sick and I loved being friends with her. Yeah. Man. Also, yes, fishing mini game. Suck! It's my favorite. It sucks because I don't know how to do it and it never got easier. Ooh, my bad. It never got me easier because you hated it so much you didn't do it. Yeah, almost all of my accounts have like full level everything except for fishing. I can't wait to give you the fishing uh, skip mini game then. Yes. Oh, hey, no. maybe we can update those things while we're in this voice call. I was just gonna suggest that. Let me finish this post that I've been procrastinating on, and then I will set that up with you and Bastard because Bastard's right there, and. You and your anxiety, my dear. <laughs> I know, you can literally see it on my face. I haven't even said anything. Uh, <laughs> you can feel it in the silence. And I don't know if you saw, but like I suggested it and then immediately like died. Regretted it. Yeah. Well, um, Bastard, you remember how to set them up, right? Vaguely. You just unzip move into mods folder uh-huh yeah i'll just send you the like link to the folder and then you... it's it's literally just one two go <laughs> because i figured out a way to actually save all of them Yay. i'll have to see if i can find it though jesus christ Now here's the question, do you want all of my mods, including the ones that I have to remove when we do multiplayer, or just the ones that are compatible with multiplayer? Just the ones that I don't have to remove when I play multiplayer. Okay. Can I still play single player with them though? Yeah, okay, so the reason why I say that is there are some mods that like, when I was trying to give you guys to play multiplayer, it would just kind of like, glitch out the game. So I, I figured out which ones, and I basically removed a ton of expansion stuff. So there's only like base expansion stuff. Um, and you don't have like all of the extra cities and stuff that I've got. Uh, I already don't have the extra cities to be fair. Yeah, I have so like- You probably would just want the regular expanded anyway. I have the uh, Stardew Valley expanded. Okay. I don't know if it's up to date. And uh, you had like 12 other. Yeah. So, like, when you set all of them, I started out with 39 mods and I ended up with 139 mods. So. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's not what? that you have like that many less. I think it's like still 100. But I removed basically all of the additional like city packs. Because and NPCs, because that was what was really just making it break down a bit. So, and honestly, the Zuzu City one is not all that interesting, to be honest. No, the Zuzu one was just completely removed. I don't even have it on my single player. I'll have to check to see which mods are in my single player that I remove whenever I go multiplayer with you guys. Be all right. Oh, wow. Hold on. I just remembered that I was in the middle of doing something when I joined this call. That's perfect. 
perfectly fine. That happens to me every time. And once we get started on the other half foundation with the main platform, that's cool. Otherwise, I'm gonna start on building the. Oh no, they're gonna make. They're gonna make us build the fucking hand. I don't wanna build the hand, I'm not building the hand. That's your own damn fault. <laughs> no, it was my fault, I suggested it. I don't wanna build the hand. Oh dear, good god. Okay. What was that? Just the video that Scarlet sent me, I can finally look at and I'm just like, oh god. Okay, uh, so let me see what specific mods I have. Uh, Steam library, Steam maps, common. Stardew Valley mods. Did I do I currently have it moved? Possibly. Yeah, I do. The last time I played Stardew, I was doing it in multiplayer. So. Um. What the fuck? Where is it? I love just losing things. It's like that's beautiful. God. <laughs> what? Just just look at in the looking glass. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> that is so accurate. <laughs> No, oh, oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I think that's why. I, I, I think. I think that's why. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> I'm. I'm sorry for laughing so hard. <laughs> was yeah, that's so good. It's like kind of true though. No, I'm just yeah, kidding. Yeah, <laughs> honestly, no. Yeah, I. I it was. It's fine. But <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, yeah, so basically what I moved, what I removed was like East Scarp and the uh, Forest Home, uh, Ridgeside Village, the train station, etc. So, that's what's, that's what's been pulled out. Oh, okay. I don't okay. English very well. I was I was like, why did you pull the trade station out of your Minecraft house? We worked so hard on that. No. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, I'm having a. <laughs> I love that. Oh, that. That's a good one, bastard. I fucking love that picture. Have you guys seen my about me for Discord? I think I have, but I don't remember what it is. Let me check. Yep. Yep, I have seen that, and I keep it. <laughs> that is a direct quote. I'm not gonna listen to it right now, I'll be honest. I, I, I love you, Scarlet, but like, mm, terror. 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 Fear and terror. Hi, Dre, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Wow, look at that. I can mark off the hydrate that you just did. Good oh job. Yes, yeah, actual good job, because does Alistar do that? <laughs> no. I got you. I forgot I went that through... moment Lita showed me how to do it. I went through and I marked dud all of your yeah. things. I'm just gonna keep doing that <laughs> gently. Just assume that you're on top enough to do them all. Wicked. Wicked. I love that you say wicked. That is the funniest word 
ever. I'm sorry, it's a local, uh, colloquialism? Colloquialism. No, it's okay, it's like, it's like when I say sick or rad. Yeah. I thought you were gonna say it. I have a friend that says Gucci and then does this, and, like, as time went on, she just stopped saying Gucci and just started doing this, and I was like, okay. And by the way, the reason why you don't know what I'm I'm saying, chat, when I say this, this is a hand movement. Oh, I'm not looking. Oh my god, an Alita flirt! I yeah, this. awesome. I'm gonna mark it as complete, because you've seen it, now you know you have to do it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, babe. Yes? Is your name Google? Because you have everything I'm searching for. Except for the more, uh, except the, the for bizarre Thor. stuff. <laughs> what, dude? Google has so much. It has so much. Unfortunately, unfortunately, I have, I have too many times googled something and had Google go, "Uh, no, I don't have that." Yeah. No, I'm just curious. Okay. Uh, I can do that, Scarlet. Well, sometimes I'll look up something like a like a show that I've watched or a quote that I've heard, or like sometimes there's just something being said over and over and over and over again in my head, and I'm like, what is this from? And then Google's like, another dimension, probably. I don't fucking know. Yeah. I freaking love Google though. I don't know why I'm holding on to this fish. Why am I holding on to this fish? He's a chub. Is it for the, the, the center? Oh uh, yeah, it could be because it's an I, I thought I opened that already, but I didn't, so. Thank you. That's what I wanted to Oh, this one does still have the um weed expansion for you, main G. Swag. Yeah, you try to doubt- I was really excited to do the- the what's on my computer thing. Yeah, and okay, I, I was- I do that. Yeah, and it just- was a train wreck. It was so sad. I got so bad. But it wasn't because of the starting. it was just because- I don't know, I was having a bad day that day. You were- are you feeling better? I mean, from that day? That was like a month ago. Yeah. I guess. This year has just been a bad day. You have no idea. I would say that 2021 was probably one of my worst years. Other than 2020, which was one of my worst years. I've been having a bad year since 2019, so I feel it. You know, I've been having I've a been bad having... life since 2016. What are y'all on about? You remember when 2012 happened? I developed anxiety because of the end of the world, and then literally every Nothing single happened. year after that, there was an event that was like, this could end the world. This could end the world. This could end the world. We're still waiting for the other shoe to drop, and it's really, really fucking annoying. I really feel like we're never going to be not waiting for the other shoe to drop, though. And that really upsets me a lot. I've been trying not to think about it too much. Oh my god, no, never mind. I'm not even gonna say it. That's I was it? going to. It, it, it's political. Oh. Text it. Text it. The cannabis of what? Hold up. Why do I feel like some of my oh Lita? Did you see? Did you see the picture of Baby Odin versus Odin now? Yes, he got squishier. What a transformation! Indeed. Why did you grow up? Why couldn't you stay little itty bitty? Yeah, that's how I felt about Tichuba. I didn't realize how big she was until we got another kit and I was like, whoa, this is a cat sized cat. <laughs> yeah, that was just like god awful. 
I'm referring to what Mangy sent and DMs. Yeah. I was like, what the fuck is 1900s bullshit? Like, what is happening? We are reverting what is so fast. Right now? Oh, oh, um, Scarlet has sent me a thing and would like my live reaction, so here you go, Scarlet. I'm watching the thing you sent me. Oh, God. I am watching their face. I will narrate. They are holding their head. Leaning heavily against their hand with a blank face. You can see the different lighting on their face. No, God! <laughs> they scream. They now have their mouth covered, one finger slightly above their nose. They draw back to speak, but they are rendered speechless. What the fuck? What the fuck? They are covering their face and screaming. Now they're just screaming. Back to covering their face, but only with their pinkies. <laughs> now I'm getting the middle finger. <laughs> the funny part is you are echoing the video perfectly. It's this guy doing a 911 call. And um, I'm watching the clip. And... Uh, you you see the meme? Uh, I'm approaching the rabbit dog. No, I don't think I have. Okay, it was like circulating on TikTok for a while. Well, uh, the whole thing is is that he calls nine one one because there's somebody in his house, and he's like, "I'm gonna go investigate," and the nine one one operator's like, "No, please don't." And yeah. um, it, and. He's like, oh, it ain't a man, it's a dog. And she's like, please don't approach the dog, it may be rabid. He's like, I'm gonna approach it. And she's like, ow! Oh. He's like, oh, he bought my face. Oh, wait, no, he's licking it. It's fine. He's like, is everything okay? I'm like, yeah, I think so. And then she's like, all right, if I might ask, how did the dog get into your house? Oh, we installed a doggy door. In case a puppy wanted to come in. It's not even a dog. <laughs> no! Kidnaps Oh my god! Dude, one of my worst exes had a cat. And we were like, I had gone over to their house and it was like really hot in my hometown and they didn't have an air conditioner. So they left like the door open. It was like late at night. But right, she had been making fun of me because I, I don't. I don't like scary movies. I was jumping every five seconds. And then. So we were watching like. Poltergeist or something. And. She, 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 like, at the end of the movie, the stupidest jump scare ever, I didn't even jump, she fucking screamed bloody murder, and then I was, like, laughing at her, because she has been making fun of me this whole time, and then she jumps at the cheapest jump scare, and then she, like, reaches over to pet her cat, and she picks it up, and she was like, you're not my cat! <laughs> it's not even her fucking it's just a random fucking cat. Dude, she was so mean to that cat. She, like, threw it outside. It was so, like, rude. Like, she wouldn't let me, like, make sure it was okay or anything. I had to, like, stand outside if I wanted to touch it. She was very, like, she was a bad person. Period. Is this the person that you told me about? Eh, yeah. The oh, P fuck. word. A car! Wait, <laughs> hey, is she the uh, one that I- that I reminded you of originally, and I was just like, eh. Yeah. No. It's just your speech patterns. That Not car. anymore. You are, like, way higher energy. <laughs> I will take that. And also way funnier and nicer and... Genuinely cares about people and is not a sociopath or a psychopath and has never threatened me with an actual knife. Um... Al, you didn't- you didn't join LGS yet, right? Right. Okay, good, because somebody named Fluffle Fluff Pony just joined, and I was just wondering- <laughs> I was just wondering, <laughs> like- Did I actually remove it? Has played Minecraft with Al? Well, well I, I didn't did. know! <laughs> I was like, okay, maybe- maybe it's because it's- oh! Lilith, you You're gonna okay? have to go. <gasps> Hi, Lilith! Oh my god, baby! 
Ivy. Are you all right? Hi, Lilith. Oh my God, Lilith, are you all right? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> from your darling daughter, or me, for my parenting skills, which, admittedly, are not the best. Don't. Thank you for the posture check. I still don't know what you're talking about, Lilith. Lilith keeps telling me like a number. And I She's telling you how many uh, points how many points they have. But I don't understand like why. Yeah, I mean like especially since you ain't bragging I got eighteen point five K, so sixty three point six thousand. Listen. Listen. I have 2,000. <laughs> oh, wow. You never fucking watch him, clearly. Yeah, I'm not on Twitch a whole lot. Another dad joke, yes. What the hell? Yeah. What the hell, what? I must have used somebody else's, uh... Mods for Stardew at one point because I was taking a look at my mods and I was like, that doesn't look right. And sure enough, most of my mods are just gone. And I'm currently trying to figure out where they went to and why. Oh, wait, how am I starting to start the day? <laughs> I just lost my sword and I can't get into the adventurer's guild to get my sword back. So we're gonna restart Dude. today. Lena, do you wanna see what my Minecraft faction expects me to be able to build? Oh dear god, yeah, sure. It's cool as fuck, but it's not happening because I don't know how to build that. Hold on, it's coming. Joke though, and I find this no. really funny. Yes. My daughter got angry when I told her sky's the limit for you. She wants to be an astronaut. No. <laughs> Look at that giant fucking hand. How cool would it be? Very cool. But I'm not your I'm not your guy. Okay, there it is! What the fuck? Why are all of my mods just gone? Why didn't the melons get married? I don't know why. Because they can't elope. I still... <laughs> I still love the... Just because a Pella can doesn't mean a Pella should. Yeah. <laughs> and he was trying to eat a capybara. Yeah. <gasps> I just remembered. Okay, this is a sandwich. It's not a sandwich, it's a burrito. Hey, You're a darling. I want to give you snuggles. Hey, bastard. Do you want to hear my grandpa's favorite joke? Yes. Why does the squirrel swim on its back? No. I, I don't know. To keep its nuts dry. No. Oh. <laughs> no! I loved my grip. He was so funny. He was about as tall as you are. And, um. Oh my just, god! Oh my god! He, he held your grip! He lived for life. I loved him. I was so he did die! No, he did die! He's <laughs> just. <laughs> he's just out now! <laughs> Sad! Well then! I think. Um, I, I don't think that's how the incarnation works, because he died in yeah, sure 13 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think you were already born. <laughs> okay, here's the thing. 
time is not a straight line. Time is a wibbly wobbly mess. Yep. Bonus points to anybody who who gets that. Wibbly wobbly. That's fair. I. Yes. I would Fortunately, consider. I would consider taking his last name if I was like changing. Like I am changing my name. I would consider if I wanted to keep it in the family to change it to his last name, but. Anyway, go on. I fortunately remembered to fucking save um the last time that I pulled out my mods and sent them to Al because ah! I feel that uh, on a spiritual level. Does that does it does that mean that Al can send them back to you though? No, it means that I already have them. It just took me for fucking uh, ever to find them. Okay. So we're Very good, she. I'm just, you know, mildly panicked. But we're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> and they do- this does not include the ones that don't work for collabs. I still can't believe what Ron said. <laughs> I can. I'm just surprised you didn't say it to me first. I love the reaction oh, that was you, Lita. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, look at look at Lita making weird fucking noises again. <laughs> uh, look at again. Damn, Lita makes a lot of weird noises though. She do though. How dare? Sometimes, damn. Good God. Look how big this fucking burrito is. What does collab stand for? Cooperative collaboration. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> collaboration. I'm so tired. I think it's part of why what happened earlier happened. Yeah. I don't know why I've been sleeping. I started taking Adderall, and I started not being able to sleep for more than five hours. Yeah. So it's every day. Speed. Oh, oh well, yeah. Every day I wake up at seven. Jesus. Because my dog has decided that he has to go pee. So I walk downstairs, start my day, take my medication, and then take like two hours to boot up. <laughs> yeah, that feels accurate. I love buying something with uh, prime shipping and then it takes forever to get to me. It's like, why do I pay for you? Yes. I feel that. It's not like paying for shipping. <laughs> That's how I felt paying for an iPad. Oh yeah, life hack for those of you that have EBT, otherwise known as food stamps, if you put that onto your Amazon account, you can get Prime for half the cost. Wag. Life hack for people who have food stamps. In some areas you could buy seeds and sprout legs for fruits and vegetables with food stamps. Okay. My understanding is though, like, everyone's like, oh, um, you could totally like make a garden and it would be like cheaper. But gardening takes so much effort. And time. And time. You would probably starve if you had to rely on that garden. <laughs> 
Yeah. You would definitely go broke. You would definitely go broke. Like, it's actually the amount of, like, you have to buy soil, seeds, water, you know, bill, so on and so forth, in order to, and then wait several months for a tomato that you could have gotten for, like, a dollar. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. You could, you could buy tomatoes and a tomato plant so that you don't have to buy tomatoes in the future. I guess the, uh, the, the idea was if you're not working and that's why you don't have enough money to feed yourself, then you should have enough time to garden. However, in this economy, uh, no, you're so no. funny. Yeah, like the people who don't have a job are probably running around taking care of their fucking kids. Or trying not to die of starvation while not having a job. This is politics again. I, I wanna have I got so much gum today, look at that. Mentos. So much gum. Ice cubes. I fucking eclipse. Damn, I got gum for days. I don't know how to. I would like grub hub. <laughs> I'm dying. Sorry. I is that right? Notice how I said I would grub hub you some, but I don't have any money. I know. It's the thought that counts. Lita has money for grub hub. What is she talking about? I know. I'm just being a bitch. Say, damn, I can't give you 50 bucks. Least you could do is send your man some gum. <laughs> you don't need any more fucking gum. <laughs> I am not Lita's man. Oh. <laughs> you just, you're like that. You know, ya yeah boy. YA boy. Or ya yeah man, YA man. Not yep. your man. My email address is literally ya.boy.alistair. <laughs> Are you sure you want to have that, like, well, they don't open know for what. anyone to email? Well, you don't know what, like, I use, maybe I use Hotmail. Maybe I use Yahoo. Maybe I use Gmail. Maybe I use oh. AOL. You never know. I mean... Eventually, I had put more that. money on AOL than anything else, and I don't know why. Sorry, the the vocal. Oh, I actually have to go live, <laughs> and I promised mom that I would have to be safe to hang out with her, so I have to go. But y'all could pop into my PC if you want to. I'll go over there. I'll come too. Oh, just now saying that I have a message from Yumeji that was like two hours ago. I'll try to remember that you sent that to me. What? No guarantees. <laughs> you sent me a message like two hours ago. <laughs> Do you actually, Lilith? Also, I dropped the link for the stop. Anyway, I'm popping into my VC. All right. Hi. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. I want everybody to wish my mom a happy Mother's Day. Please and thank you. Oh, of course. This is not up for debate. I'm not a monster. I mean, she's my mom, too, so, like, of course. Oh. I mean, she's my future mother-in-law, so, like, why would I? Say it, I forgot. Oh, oh, do you want to hear something funny? So, when I gave my mom her Mother's Day present, I said to her, I was gonna give you a dollar for every year you've been a mom, but I didn't have five dollars. She's like, What do you mean? And then she opened the card and there's 20 bucks in it. I was like, 
I didn't have five dollars. <laughs> I'm 25. I think my mom forgot how old I was. <laughs> Possibly, yeah. I mean, that's okay. I do too. I'm so glad I made it. Okay, now I actually have to set everything up. Am I ever like prepared on time for streaming? Never. No, if no, you, I am not. If you were, I would be so shocked. You know what? Just for that, I'm some point going to like work my ass off to to be so. I hope so. I think the funniest yeah. part of this is that you would have to work your ass off. You're like, uh, I, in order to be on time, I have to work my ass <laughs> off. And not just, like, start a couple minutes earlier. <laughs> like, you have to, like, take a shower. Okay. And, like, like, go through the whole Here's rainbow. The thing. Like, you do not understand <laughs> just how bad it is for me to remember to do things at a reasonable time. I felt that. I felt that. It's an ADHD No, he does thing. understand. He lives with me. <laughs> I'm like, constantly... I'm... Oh my god. And also, sometimes, I don't know about with you, but like with me, it's hard sometimes to push me to do stream because the startup is the worst part. And then stream is fine. It's coasting. I like streaming, but I don't like starting. Because I always fuck up and then I'm always angry at myself and it's like World War Three. Oh, hello, Pixie! Oh my god, I feel like Pixie walking in is the equivalent of Dobby walking in, but less aggressive. Well, uh, uh, Pixie walks in, everyone's like, oh, hi. Dobby walks in, and we're like, get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out! Because she attacks my cats, though. She's rude. Yeah, that's fair. She's like, I'm the biggest, baddest bitch around here, and she's like a, a, a chipipple. A chipple. Ch chipipple? Yeah, Chipibble. A Chipibble. A Chipibble. Since Pixie's just a sweet, straight chihuahua. She's so sweet. <laughs> she, she do bork a lot, though. Yeah. Which she, is valid, she honestly. She loves to be the center of attention, it's fine. Speak your mind, queen. Dobby's just traumatized. No, Dobby just hates cats. And Dobby's traumatized. That's why she doesn't like people. But she's... Just me to buy cats for no reason. Also, probably because Tichima is a little shit. Tichima be like, dude, when Tichima's on catnip, she like attacks Kimo. <laughs> it's like, but like doesn't like really attack him because she can't really do any damage. Not really. No, oh, she's never done. Uh, except for like the first week he was here, we kept coming home to see that he had like little scratches on his nose, and on he I was nose. like, on he nose, yeah. That's I because, like, the cats the were establishing boundaries and stuff, and they were like, don't fucking touch me. I don't care. Yeah. I love the way that you talk, Mankey. You're just adorable. No. Damn those. And hubby got me wanting to play Stardew, plus it's Mother's Day stream with mom, so we're gonna do that. Like it. What are we playing tomorrow? Red Dead. Oh, we are? Really? Uh, well, that was the suggestion that was made. I haven't started playing it though, and honestly, I probably will only play it with you. Like Red Dead? Yeah. Well, because Lena likes to leave our streams like to, like till the last minute to really decide. So it's really just like a uh, like grab bag and a surprise when we start. I'm just like, oh okay. Doing anything with Mangy ever. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. 
Sometimes they'll make plans. How do you spell Demetresk? That's okay, Cory. Dear and God, good luck. Are popping in. And they'll plan it down to like the last second. And then they'll just decide to not. Like day of. I'm not feeling it. Oh my god, Lilith, Lilith typed it. Oh, is it mama? It Hello. is. Wow. I restarted the computer, so I'm a little late. I apologize. It's okay. Happy I was Mother's still on day. the just starting stream. <laughs> Happy Mama's Day, Mama. Thank you, and thank you so much for the message on the Kudo board. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I did not realize that my hubby had done a message on the Kudo board. Good job, baby. Yes. Sweetie, so many people did. I was just. Happy crying. Happy crying. And you want to know the funny thing? Jimbo still apologized to me for it not being released this morning. Why? Because it was today. It was so much better when I came home from work. Tired and, you know. I haven't changed any of my rules, Uni. Not even remembering that it was Mother's Day and. I come home and that actually was not the first message I got. The first one was from someone else who I guess didn't know about the Twitter board that added me saying thank you for being a, a great example and being corpse street mom. And I'm like, happy cry, happy, happy love. Day. And then I got, I scrolled down just a little bit more on my notifications and found the Kudo board and it was like, oh, what? I, I was just, <laughs> was just. It's okay, Yuri. You're good. You're good. We love you. I'm crying. crying. I had to restart, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, it's all right. Happy Mother's Day. <clears throat> Mom, we can hear your computer in the background. That wasn't me. I literally. I'm sitting here doing absolutely nothing. Who's got my stream up and unmuted? Oh, that's me. That's me. Okay, mute tab. There we go. Yeah! Okay. See, it was, was you. you! It was me. <laughs> but it wasn't me typing, it was you typing. No, that's me typing. I'm aware that that's me typing. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to mute. Oh, shit. Mm. Yeah, go I don't... cut her some slack. It's Mother's Day. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Um, there were a couple of things that I said I would talk about on stream if that's okay. Of course. Okay. I want to know why you were asking me if I thought you were straight or not. I'm like, I don't okay. know. That's, that's the your first one. That's the first one. And yet, it's a little weird. Um, there's there's a game that you play on Twitter that you follow a channel and they give you a prompt every day and if you do or you don't <laughs> don't do that I lost my train of thought um, if you do or you don't um, whatever the prompt is then you have to unfollow, and the last person following wins. Oh! That's what you meant by the unfollow game. I thought that you were asking people to unfollow you on Mother's Day for something kind of, that I saw kind of frivolous. No, 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 no. it's a literal game, okay. It's a game. It's a game. Man, and I, I just wanna say, Major you to hydrate just as I took a sip of my soda. <laughs> yes! Good no, Good no free hydrates. Uh, so this is this is kind of for everybody um i sit in my chair funny i mostly like guys but i have been known to have a crush on it you're Should on I the spectrum follow? honey you are not straight you are on okay. the spectrum I think okay everybody's on the spectrum i thought so because you're right it's a spectrum right i'm not totally straight i never knew anybody who was decent who was totally straight I'm, got the vibe that you were 
<laughs> I do get served a lot. Oh, uh, but yeah. Okay, that was the first one. The second one is the mother's day thing. Mm -hmm. And oh yeah, a new game guess the sexuality. Honey, mm -hmm. it's anybody's guess with me because I don't even know. Um But when when I was growing up we made a big deal out of Mother's Day. And then I grew up, I had kids, and my mother, who still wanted us to make a big deal out of her for Mother's Day, told my children that it was a Hallmark holiday and not to celebrate it for me. Oh. I don't remember those exact words, but she did basically downplay it quite a lot. Wow. She told, I mean, she honestly said that to you girls both several times and here's the thing even and if she said that about all holidays i would like to make a point that she said that about all holidays except for christmas well what? any holiday she wanted to celebrate that mm. is the hallmark <laughs> holiday exactly yeah. i mean i would argue that it was valentine's day it the hallmark holiday is the one where hallmark made it up just so you buy more cards anyway yeah the thing is, is that even if the girls didn't believe that, first off, they're being told by the adults in their life not to celebrate me. Because Lita's father left when she was one. Mm -hmm. And so, obviously, he didn't want me celebrated. He wanted his wife celebrated. Who I wasn't going to fucking celebrate. <laughs> she was every evil stepmother from every fairy tale ever. Not wrong. And you think I'm joking? I'm not. Women She's set my dolls on fire because my sister didn't have them. Mm -hmm. My stepsister. Oh my fucking god. Fuck your stepmom, bro. What the fuck? Here's the thing. They were Sailor Moon dolls. I was the only one who was into Sailor Moon. My stepsister did not give a shit. Dude, oh, no. Truly evil stepmom, Lilith. Truly evil. I kept telling her, leave your stuff here. I, I, they were my security blankets so you know even worse they yeah. actually put doors that were locked that only they could undo um but they could see over for my room and my stepsisters because they didn't like how i would go into her room at night and sleep in the same bed as her because we were really close we were the exact same age we basically acted like twin sisters um at the time we're not close anymore but like and here's the oh, thing, the they did not like how resourceful I was, because I basically climbed over the, the door. What killed me was the whole reason they didn't want me doing that is because my stepsister got a full-size bed pretty early on in life. I still had a cot that I slept on with a full-size right next to me, and I wasn't allowed to sleep in a full-size bed until... I think they, they made up a lie if I had to stop peeing the bed, which it wasn't a problem. But they used the evidence that at one point I puked in the bed because I was sick and they weren't letting me out of my bedroom. And they made me clean it up in the middle of the night while sick. And then I think that my, my father finally put his foot down and was like, no, she's going to get to sleep in the full size bed with her favorite movie on tonight. This is not acceptable. <laughs> Because yeah. he was not abusive. She was. She was abusive. He was neglectful. He anyway. was neglectful mostly because he was a child. He was a man-child. He still is. <laughs> anyway. Um, so, <gasps> basically, basically, they... They and my mother discouraged my children from celebrating Mother's Day. And when you're a kid... If you don't have an adult that's actively helping you, it's really hard to go out and buy anything or even make a card. And you don't remember what day it is. No. So I still I... don't remember what day it is. Exactly. Yeah. This is the first year I've actually remembered that it was Mother's Day, and that's because it was like a huge protest thing on Twi on TikTok about it. Mm -hmm. And it, it's it, it was very much one of those things where they really honestly couldn't do anything about it 
and all of the other adults in their lives were actively discouraging it because they did not want me to be close to my kids. They really didn't. Mom succeeded with my older daughter. She does not speak to me. Nope. Doesn't speak to me either, which I think was an unintended but delightful con um, <laughs> consequence for her. Whereas I'm really lonely because I, I miss my older sister. By the way, yes, I do technically have two sisters. You will never hear me talk about either one of them because we are estranged. Yay. I get that. Yeah. There's a grandparents' day? Yes, there is. Thank you for never left. informing me of that. You know, if your gross father had lived longer, you would have known. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But hey, if I'm not supposed to celebrate Mother's Day because it's a Hallmark holiday, then I don't need to celebrate Grandmother's Day. That was kind of my take. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I have had today the best Mother's Day I have ever had in my entire life. And it is all thanks to all of you. Oh, that's so sweet. Because I honestly, Lita and Jimby and all of my other kids, wow, you guys. And Luke, I never ask for grandchildren because I'm not that kind of person. But oh my god, I'm so glad you're here. I would not give you up for anything. But I, it, it was just coming home from work and finding that when I didn't expect anything at all was just like, I was okay, crying. Excuse me. I will be right back. I'm going to um, mute my mic. So everybody, you're still going to hear from them, but I'm going to be on, an, on the just chatting screen and turn off my mod for a bit. I apologize. Um, there's something I need to deal with real quick. Okay. No problem. And yes, this is a faction. Because I absolutely love my granddaughter. Actually, I love all of you guys. What am I talking about? Aww. So how is everybody tonight? I had an interesting... Day, night. Okay. I had an interesting start of stream. Okay. I, I had a regular, like, Mother's Day. Mm hmm. Same old, same old, just like, here's your presents. Let's go out somewhere. Okay, let's hit up the cemetery. And there, yeah, that's Ew. it. Ew. Actually, I like cemeteries. Me too. Um, our local cemetery doesn't clean up. So, um, usually around holidays and what have you, we tend to go to the cemetery and my dad cleans up their graves because nobody else mm -hmm. does, so. Yeah. Oh, Uni, I'm sorry. I, I, I hope you get to talk to her soon. Six pop tarts seems excessive, but okay. six pop tarts is a little much. <laughs> I do it all the time, so I can't say anything. <laughs> to be honest, though, two pop tarts really sounds like not enough. So maybe like three or four pop tarts is enough. Well, what I'll do is I'll buy a box of pop tarts, and that'll be lunch. Pop tarts because, are good though. Because I'm horrible, and I do. Stuff like that. <laughs> what is your guys' favorite flavor of Pop Tart? Oreos. The, the <gasps> cookies and cream one. My dad just bought me those. Or the coffee <laughs> one. Or chocolate. I like the cinnamon <sighs> roll. <gasps> the cinnamon one. Yui, <gasps> hello. I don't think I had that one. Oh my god, I'm so happy you're here. Okay, I promised. I promised the cats that I would hold them while while we were on stream. 
and I have just been reminded of this fact. You said you would hold me. Hi. You said. I am so glad you're here. I loved your message. Oh God, I, I, was, I really loved seeing you there. I was just, I didn't expect it and I was very, very happy. Hmm, last time I had a Pop-Tart was last time they were on sale. <laughs> I don't eat pop tarts very often because my family are psychopaths that only buy the fucking fruit ones. Oh, wow. Oh my god, I feel that. That's one of the great things about adulting is that I can buy a pint of ice cream or a box of pop tarts and that be lunch. I I can too, but it will be lunch for someone else, and it's so sad. Oh. I just don't buy myself anything. Oh. It's so sad. Yeah. Uh, pop tart is kind of like uh, it's it's called a pop tart because it pops out of the 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 toaster, but it's like it's a it's kind of like a fruit ravioli or a chocolate ravioli that you put in the toaster. It is a pastry that has a filling that is flavored and an icing. Yeah, some of them have icing, not all of them. And yeah. they, they are designed to go in the toaster. Um, but they're... They're really junk food. Yeah, they're not... It, it is good, but it's also like... Like, it's not like real fruit and icing. It's like... Sugar fruit paste and ice cream <laughs> icing. Yeah, the frozen strudel ones are nice. I like those. But honestly... The, the cinnamon roll because it's it's basically cinnamon and brown sugar stuff between two pieces of not so really good pastry but somehow yes it's like a guilty pleasure pastry yeah <clears throat> cinnamon is so tasty though I I gotta say though I, I kind of I'm kind of sad that I associate cinnamon with spicy and nothing else because of the fucking red hots. I love cinnamon. And the only thing I like to do with Red Hots is put them in apple butter to make cinnamon apple butter. Oh, yes. That <laughs> delicious. It was. Oh, I remembered something else I did today. What did you do? I made homemade bread. Really good. What kind? Just regular white bread. No. Oh. Next that. time I go wait. <laughs> I feel that. <laughs> but still, homemade bread is absolutely the best. I learned to make it very early, and I don't do it nearly often enough because I don't really have time. Yeah, this is my well, first couple times making bread ever, so I'm just like. Uh... Yeah, when when I was younger and and. My oldest daughter was small. I was all into being very healthy and everything else. And I made all the bread for for the house. Yeah, you know, we didn't buy bread, I made the bread. <clears throat> and everybody was unhappy about this. And it's like, really? That's so good. So I stopped. Because it Dude, I bet your bread is so good. The last time we made bread, it turned out brick-like in nature. Um, your yeasty beasties were not happy. No, they were not. It was supposed to be like bread for like, what was it? Like, uh, was it? I don't know. I don't fucking remember. Never mind. <laughs> but yeah, no. It was like for a holiday. But... Yeah, but it, it I, w I was doing the very, very hippie thing. I would make, you know, homemade bread and homemade jam, and and nobody appreciated that. Oh my god. They wanted store bought. And it was like, okay, fine. Why am I going to all this trouble if nobody wants it? Yeah. That makes me sad. I kind of want to, like, make. Um. Uh, 
I want to be able to make most of my own stuff. I mean, granted, I don't like jelly or jam, but I would have adored bread. Mm -hmm. You might have liked mine. Don't you like jelly or jam? Because, like, know. because, like, homemade cinnamon apple butter on homemade whole wheat bread, that is really good. But yeah, I, apple I butter is a little different, though. Amazing. Odin is having a time upstairs. I can hear him. Bastard made apple butter the other day. I didn't like it, but that was not his fault. <laughs> it's just because I got no taste buds. <clears throat> oh, yeah, because you don't feel good, so. Yeah. Well, I, well mean, I mean, I wasn't sick at the time. I just didn't like what he, he made me. <laughs> Never had apple butter. Okay. I don't like regular apple butter. I had to put cinnamon in it to make it okay for me. <clears throat> because it's it's kind of like apple jam. It's not apple jelly, it's like Well, there's like a whole scale of of fruit spread, let's call yeah. it. And uh, butter, fruit butters like pumpkin butter and and yeah. apple butter. Um are pretty much just overcooked. It's it's like mashed potatoes, but for fruit this time. <laughs> and it's there's more liquid in it, so it's thinner. You're not wrong. It, it's it, yeah. The the fruit butters are basically mashed fruit. super easy to make. If you've ever made applesauce, you can make apple butter. Yeah, it's very similar. Apple butter is just cooked down a little bit more so it's thicker and easier to spread rather than being thinner. <clears throat> I, um, I made apple butter the, the other day because all of the apples were going bad, but no one was going to eat them. Because there was an unreasonable amount. So, mm. I made apple butter because it keeps. And someone's going to eat it. But I also used a, a half bottle of Prosecco. Okay. Because we couldn't get the cork back in it. Uh -oh. <laughs> so it was boozy apple butter. <laughs> it, it was okay. <laughs> the, the last time we had too many apples, I made apple pie. Oh my god, I would kill for apple pie right now. You have a chocolate pie? Mm hmm? Prosecco is like wine, right? Yeah, it's, it's a type of wine. It's a sparkling white wine. Like champagne. But technically, you can't call it champagne unless it came from Champagne, France. Kind of like you can't Prosecco. call sweet onions Vidalias unless they came from Vidalia, Georgia. Are you yeah. serious? Yeah. Oh my god, I didn't know this. Yes. What? <laughs> <laughs> my life I'm has just been well. changed. Mm. Oh my god, my entire life is just... Well, uh, honey. But yes, yeah, cinnamon makes everything good. Provably. I'm sorry, hold on. I'm sorry, cinnamon is one of my favorite flavors. Cinnamon did not make my oatmeal the other day taste good. But mm. to be fair, I made like a single serving of oatmeal. I accidentally put like a whole friggin' tablespoon of cinnamon in there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so, that's, that's on me. That's not on the cinnamon. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That, oh, that was a lot of cinnamon. That's really funny, actually. I'm sorry that happened to you, babe. 
it's okay. That's that's the oatmeal that Melis took away from me. <laughs> good, good, baby. No, I was hungry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait. Sorry, everybody, I'm dumb. I was like, I need to go back to my house and get all my sound and batteries. But they're in my inventory. So how was the cumin on your apple oatmeal? I have to ask. Honestly, yeah, that sounds interesting. Lately, I'm not putting cinnamon in my oatmeal. I'm putting blueberries and pecans. But that's because my oatmeal is really hot when it comes out of the microwave. So I'm in a hurry and I use frozen blueberries to cool it down. <laughs> So I can eat it. Ah. That's something. Oh. I do not like blueberries. You don't like blueberries? No, I don't like blueberries. They're, um, I thought this. They're always super squishy. Oh, yeah, especially after they've been frozen and heated. Yeah, so I don't. I don't really like blueberries, but that's because it's a, it's like a texture thing. Hi, yeah. Savage Clown. How are you? I, I have that problem with um, like okra and avocados and bananas specifically. I love okra so much. I do not like the I do not like the texture of okra at all. No. Right. Hello, Savage Clown. I'm sorry. <laughs> Why are you apologizing? You're not Alita! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not Lita! Don't be. The world couldn't stand two of her. Oh god. Fair enough. <laughs> I mean, honestly, the world really couldn't stand two of any of us. We have to be unique, because otherwise, things will implode. And that's such a mess. Sweetie, listen. We were just in that cave. Object permanence Ooh. is a problem in our today's society. And even if you cook it well, okra is still kind of... Mm. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like okra. <laughs> not, not a fan, no. Not a fan. But I mean, I, I'm there's... I'm very weird that way because that's the same reason I don't like tomatoes or um, bananas, and everybody loves tomatoes and bananas, and it's like, well, you know, eat tomatoes raw like apples. They really do. It freaks me out. Yeah. They will like pick up a big like steakhouse or um what are they called like the beef beef steak. The beef steak, yeah, there we go. To pick beef steak, tomatoes, and just crunch it into it like it's a friggin' apple. I can't can stand tomatoes. Actually, oh, I can actually tell you same. why. They do the exact same thing. My grandpa, okay, so. They're a fruit, I mean, you know. My, uh, I was spending the night at my dad's house because my dad separated from my mom. And, uh, I, my grandpa, I was looking for apples, right? Because I wanted, I was hungry. And I bit it into uh, a tomato, and I really didn't like it at first, because I was expecting an apple. <laughs> but my grandpa was like, I tried to tell you that was not an apple. And I just ate the whole thing out of pride. And then I was like, damn, I really like these, actually. <laughs> that is awesome. That is so awesome. I mean, she is very motivated by spite. I am I so motivated tell. by spite. I can tell. That's actually how I learned how to draw. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, like I was trying to get somebody to help me out because I had this uh, whole story written up. It was like a whole comic series. I had it all planned out. I had all the characters and everything. I had spent like two years on it at that point. 
and mm -hmm. I had talked to somebody and I was like, hey, you're an artist, would you like to work with me on it? And she was supposed to help me. Plus yeah. she just took all of my notes and posted it on her own. And then oh. when I tried to say something about it, she was like, well, I mean, mm -hmm. I have all the notes. So I learned how to draw. And I did not finish that story. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Honestly, though, same. And this is so well known about me that when I hurt my arm, and I guess everybody's heard that story now. Uh, I didn't know. My, I know. my ex, Lita's dad, we were dating at the time. And he comes into my hospital room the next morning. And he's already talked to the doctor. And he walks in and he says, the doctor says you're never going to use that hand again. The doctor was like, oh my god, what did you tell her that for? He said, watch. <laughs> and, oh my god, I'm so glad your hand works then. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, they, they thought I would not get very much use out of it. But she wanted me to get as much as possible. So she didn't want anybody to tell me that it was so bad. You know, because I'd cut all the nerves, and I'd never be able to use it. And it was like, just watch me die. I oh, love that. Tell me I can't watch. <clears throat> and and I did. I mean, I I basically people cannot tell that I have ever had an injury. And once in a while, um, I'll get, like, lower blood circulation because of some of the scar tissue. And I'll be like, I need to go warm my hand up. <laughs> okay, what? <laughs> I'm like, ah, yeah, okay. It's it's feeling cold. Did I stutter? It, yeah. I mean, yeah. It's like, I need to warm my hand up or it's going to quit working. Oh, well, why is your hand going to quit working? Because I cut it off and they put it back on, but it doesn't work quite the same anymore, okay? Just... Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Whole ass cut it off? Huh? You... Yeah. What? That's yeah. terrifying. Yes. I, I you would... that? I dropped glass on it. Did you not hear this story already? Yeah, no. Oh. Are you, wait, are you talking about with the... I didn't realize that you cut your hand off! Okay, technically, it was still attached. I did not break the bone. So oh it's still on there with the bone and some pieces of it. Oh my god. <laughs> That's horrifying. It was pretty bad. Um, they, they told me that it looked like the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Oh my god. <laughs> Where I had cut it. And I'm like... I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to make a mess. <laughs> but yeah, apparently it, it was pretty severe to clean up. <laughs> I felt really bad about that. Which is a funny thing to feel bad about when you just like, seriously injured yourself. Yeah, exactly. Like, I'm sorry, I made a mess. <laughs> Sorry, I'm causing you this inconvenience. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, they they told me no, we will never. Or he told me, oh, we'll never use it again. That's what they're saying. <laughs> they don't know me very well. So yeah, I I totally get Mangy with the spite. Because sometimes fight will motivate you better than anything else. Yes. Yes. Exactly. Nimble. Bet. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. And I don't like doing dishes. I friggin' hate doing dishes. Me too. <laughs> He's also, like, the only person in our household that does dishes, though. Mm -hmm. <gasps> it sucks. Well, everyone else hates doing dishes more than I hate doing dishes. 
To be fair, I did dishes for like a really long time and I kept telling everybody, if you do not scrape off your plate, I will not wash it. And nobody scrapes off their place plate, so I stopped washing dishes. Oh god. I live in a house of five. <clears throat> we have no we have no dishes right now because I've been sick for over a week. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I so, like, I was three days into being sick, and on the first day, I had asked someone if they would be willing to do the dishes. I asked so many times. Mm -hmm. I'm not feeling well. Would you please do the dishes? So, after we did not have any dishes, like, like two days later, we were like, freaking out of dishes. So I was absolutely pissed. I washed all of the dishes. I cleaned the entire kitchen, even though I'm sick. Then I went to Winco and dropped two hundred and fifty dollars on groceries because we've never had any groceries that I can eat, especially when I'm sick. They're mm -hmm. planning on going to food, but like I, I was just, I was done. Yeah, no, like, livid. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. no. I was so sick, and people, oh, like, I came home, put away all of the groceries, and everyone was just like, are, are you okay? No, I'm sick. Thanks for helping. Yeah. yeah, no, I'm not okay. I've been telling everyone that I'm sick. Mm -hmm. And no one's, no one's fucking out but me. Oh my lord. Except for, except for me. My... It's a very complicated situation, but I, uh, I definitely get the neglectful parent thing. Mm-hmm. Well, one of the reasons I went, I went ahead and did my dishes before stream was because I like to go ahead and do all of them, like, right after dinner. So that I don't have to worry about it for the rest of the evening. Oh yeah, that's what I do. And with only there's there's just one of me, so there's like maybe maybe four or five plates and yeah, assorted other stuff. Uh, tonight I did have to wash spoons because I don't typically do them always with the dishes. I have plenty of spoons and. I have to do them separately because they're silver plated. Oh, no. So I can't, I can't just take like the the scrubby that I use on plates and pots, and run it across the spoons, because <laughs> then I will end up scratch spoons. So no. Um. So I had to wash my spoons because I needed spoons. And if you know spoon theory, that's funny. Yeah. I, uh, I read this whole thing about, you know, fork theory. Mm hmm Um, whereas, like, you, you have a threshold for as many forks that you can stand, like, in your yeah. emotional thing. Yes. Um, and, like, the different sized forks and everything, because, like, you have salad forks and serving forks and entree forks and crab forks and appetizer forks and like uh, uh, it's just a lot yeah mm -hmm. but yeah yeah and work is usually a serving fork yup mm -hmm. wasn't too bad today I did the order and it was I didn't have the manager I swear to god it's easier without him oh my god It shouldn't be. I agree. <laughs> I think... <sighs> I think people just complicate things in their attempt to, to be good. Okay, and here's the problem. Not He's <laughs> not good. He's not trying to be good. He's lazy. L-A-Z-Y. And he uses the excuse of, oh, well, 
I'm older and I hurt. I got 10 years on the dude. Yeah, it's like bitch can't lie. <laughs> he, only, he only uses that because you don't look it. Cracked it. Yeah. I'm, I'm sitting here crumpled up in my chair like a teenager. I mean... B, I look like a fucking shrimp. <laughs> okay, I am not being a shrimp. I have one foot up and one knee up. And the foot in the chair. Yeah. And the cat is complaining because in this position I have no lap. Feel that. Tijima all the fucking time. <laughs> <laughs> it was so sad earlier. Malice and Tijima uh, came and they curled up with me. And then, as soon as they got comfortable, I had to get up. Because we needed water. Because we needed water. And then I went to the store. Then I bought everything except the water. Then I came home. <laughs> And then I got home and I was like, shit, I forgot the one thing I left for. Oh, jeez. So I had to go back to the fucking store. I told him not to. <laughs> I was like, it's fine, don't worry about it, you bought soda. And he was like, no water! Yeah. Which was fine because I did make, like, a huge stink. I was like, bro, I have been needing water for a long time. Where's Lita? Yeah, I, have I hope idea. she's okay. Um, well, I, I don't know about everybody else, but I sleep on my side most of the time. I sleep on my stomach. Yeah, me too. Yeah. If I'm not hugging a pillow. Oh, sometimes I sleep on my side because I have a body pillow, and so I'll, like, cling to it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, I do the pillow thing as well. Except that I usually <laughs> have a pillow up against my back because I have a cat. That wants cuddling, and she does. She she acts like she wants to be a stuffed animal. She rolls over on her back, and wants her belly scratched, and it's just kind of like I can't lay on my stomach very comfortably unless I'm very careful because too much in front. <clears throat> I would be happy to get rid of that. Sometimes I'll lay down. Uh, I wake up and my arms are in like a perfect O. As mm. if I was like hugging something that is not there. Like cuddling a pillow up next to my head. Mm. Because every malice. time it happens, Malice, my littlest cat, has nuzzled her way into my arms so that I will cuddle her while she sleeps, and I'm sleeping, so she's like right next to my head, cuddling, and then just the little nest of sleepy arms. Is all, of my, all of my cats are my head. Okay, when, when I'm on my stomach, it's painful. Because, yeah. I want top surgery. <laughs> oh, don't we all? Just get rid of them. I mean, mine are minuscule and have always- DUDE! Oh my god, I just- I just remembered, like, <laughs> one of my friend's moms, she was, like, really close. She passed away recently, but, um, she would tell me that if I slept on my stomach, that's the reason I had flat boobs, and that was so sad. Why you gotta be that way? <laughs> That's so not true. <laughs> I'm like, what the f- died like you. I used to sleep on my stomach when I was a kid, and trust me, it, it, it didn't help. I wish I did. Oh, so do I. I'd have never slept any other <laughs> way. Oh my god. Yeah, we, we, we just need to, like, contract a doctor to just do us all. Oh, all at the same time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why not? Snip, 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 snip. Mm -hmm. I have consultation at the end of the month. 
Excellent. Okie dokie, I'm so happy for you. Yeah! Oregon, Oregon State Health Care Plan pays for it? Yep, they're gonna cover everything. <gasps> That's amazing. I don't know, Lilith, but honey, if I could give you mine, I would. Yeah, if we could all just collectively give a little bit to mm. Lilith. Um, Lita is a little bit, um, we're not sure where she is. She is disposed. We're, we're just sitting here vibing. Uh, she said she has a crisis, so, uh, we'll see. Oh, God. Uh, yeah. Because I messaged her and asked her if she was okay. She says, oh, she said it's a crisis. So, oh. oh, God. Okay. Very <coughs> casual. Yeah. Okay, well, we can discount everybody here. Well, yeah, I, I said, are you, are you okay, babe? She says, yeah, crisis. That's, that's all she said. Yeah, oh, God. crisis. I love Lita. Sometimes she's like, she cracks me the fuck up. <laughs> she's uh, almost Potato, like, I'm she's... pretty sure she, she'll be okay. Yeah, she'll be fine. If not, I, I think... have to drive up there and get her. Yeah, I think she underestimates herself a lot. I do too. Oh, the flower dance. I don't have anybody. <coughs> that sucks. Mm. I'm sorry, Star. That's okay. They're not good enough for me anyway. Mm, you're Fair enough. Anybody. You know what? You're just remembering your worth. It's fine. There's. Uh, I have there's to conserve potato. Yes, you do. My last world, my, my last illustrated event world that I took seriously, I was befriending several of the, like, mom characters, like, married women in town. Mm hmm. So I thought it was very funny. And uh, in my first year, I got, I think it's Caroline, for the Winter Star Festival. Yeah. So I had to give her something. And she's like, oh my god, thank you so much. This is so sweet for blah blah blah. She said something about um, being very cold. And. <laughs> Her husband's not there. He doesn't come there until like the year after. He comes year two. Yeah, so I was fine. like, hey, maybe I'll help you. Like, <laughs> that's Jody, not Carolyn. I think. Okay, Jody's yeah, my bad. favorite though. Bad name. Jody's sweet. Well, but... Just all, if all my Mm-hmm. I like Robin, but that's because Robin likes working with wood. So do I. Oh, yes, that makes sense. <laughs> I like Robin too, but for different Robin's reasons. Cool. Hmm. Well, for a little while, I got to be a carpenter, so that was fun. Yeah. How long? How long did you do that? Um. Well, I can't like. Subvert your mom. But yeah, branches. Branches, no. Maybe like parallel bars with a pad or even unparallel bars. Um, where you're not gonna like break something if you fall. But branches can break. Oh, that reminds me. I need to tell Lita that the peach tree she despises blew over last night. Why does cool. she despise the peach tree? Yeah. Because my mom planted it and called it hers and she never wanted it. And... Mom was good about this shit like that. <clears throat> she insisted I plant a tree in the backyard and 
Oh, look, it's growing. You don't have a black phone. I'm going to register that. You know? Still don't want a garden. Didn't oh, expect to want her to be there. Yeah, that's fair. I have garlic growing right now. Yeah? Well, some of them. Some of them have liquidized. Have you ever... Have you removed the ones that are dead? I started poking at a couple of them, but... Not... Not thoroughly. I might go and do that tomorrow. Because every time I go and go to do it, I'm in the middle of something. Garlic is good for keeping bugs away. Yes. I like garlic. If Things just here... kind of grow naturally here, though. Like, uh... We got, like, wild... What is it called? Snowdrops and bluebells? And I've never, never seen, seen that before, but that's because I grew up in a desert. Uh, I'd never seen, like, uh, wild flowers. Like, I didn't know that tulips were, like, real, I guess. I just thought that all tulips were, like, made of plastic. <laughs> and, like, they kind of look like they're made of plastic, but I've touched one. They're, like, real-ass flowers. Yeah. Yes. yes. You know... I'm like, guys, guys, <laughs> flowers, flowers grow on the side of the road, and it's just, it's so pretty. There's like hundreds of different colored flowers and little white daisies that, that grow in parks that aren't weeds and don't hurt when you step on them. What? <laughs> Dude, I love this place. It's like the Garden of Eden. I've made it. I'm happy. <laughs> I've, like, yeah, I've never really seen wildflowers before. You know what grows wild in my hometown? Mm. Cactuses. Mm. Tumbleweeds. Yucca trees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those, oh, oh, the ones that grow really good. What are they? The the plants that tequila is made out of. Aloe vera. Oh, no. Agave. Agar. Oh, man. I made my mom so mad one day. They had a... They had an agave plant in the back of uh back in the back field okay. behind my house. And I was like, Mom, will you help me drag it? And she was like, No, it's nasty and it has black widows on it. And I was like, But mom, she's dying out there. And my mom was like, Why do you have to personify everything? <laughs> and so she's Hi. all crying and trying to cut off the little like seed saplings and she's like, Don't worry, Mama, I'll save your baby. Hey, Welcome Lita. back, baby. What happened? Um. <sighs> Things. Are you I had okay? a mild crisis. I'm okay. Um, but I had to step away for a minute to uh, pour through something. So everything's fine. I'm fine. Okay. Hi, Potato. Hi, you. Uh, hi, everyone. Wow. I have no idea how long I was gone for, but it was a fairly long time. Hi, actually. Oh, God. Almost an hour. Lovely. <laughs> it's okay. We were keeping up company. Yeah. Thank you. We were having fun. Mm -hmm. I appreciate about, you. We were talking about everything from cooking to wildflowers. Ooh. Which is, mm -hmm. Sounds like a good like survival book. So somebody uh, somebody was saying don't cut don't cut the, the flowers, you know, for the bees and I'm like, you know, if you got bees, send them my way because I got two types of roses right now. Two types of clover. Um never mind all the rest of it. <laughs> I do. And this is all growing wild. No, we're not yeah. cooking or, or at least we're not cooking you. We get, we get wild blackberries. You know, I used to go and gather wild blackberries and make jam out of them. And I quit doing that when I almost picked up a snake too. I have a thing about snakes. I had a snake named Iggy Woods. Well, this snake was laying on top of the blackberries. And I didn't look closely enough to see if it was a rattlesnake or not, but we do have them. Yeah, you could kill me out of that. Yeah. I think it's too cold for rattlesnakes up here, but I don't know. <clears throat> yeah, I definitely think so. 
But yeah, it's too um, cold for Black Widows, and that is so cool. I didn't know that. I I had to Google it because when we moved up here, my car, we were cleaning out my car, and I pulled out one of the uh, the the car like what is it called? The seat the, under the seat, the fucking foot pads, whatever. Anyway. Mm -hmm. So, like, I pulled out one of those and I put it on the floor and there was this massive fucking black widow on it. And, like, my neighbors were like, what the fuck kind of spider is that? I was like, what, you've never seen a black widow before? Oh god, she was huge. Also, she was so big. We have a Pacific Northern Rattlesnake. It's a Northern Pacific Rattlesnake. Yeah. Black. I don't know what kind of rattlesnakes these are, but Potato, if you think snakes are cute, I want you to, some evening when you are half asleep, open a kitchen drawer and have a rattlesnake rear its head up at you and look at you. Oh, Jesus Christ. Dude, I get the shit bitten out of me because I would have been like, is that a oh, snake? Here, hold I'm, on, let me touch it to see if it's a snake. Yes. If you don't touch rattlesnakes, they will kill you. I levitated them. <laughs> I am not joking. I levitated to the other side of the room. G defied oh, gravity. Man, I had a Hell no. like, I don't know what to call him, a stalker Bur who brought me a rattlesnake tail. Oh. <laughs> yeah. He was weird. Mm -mm. Sorry if I'm not talking much, you guys. Um, <laughs> my my heart is kind of killing me right now. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'll be okay. Everything's fine. Just you, you know, sure? anxiety. Yeah, the more Thank you, you for popping that, in and like. The hmm? less I believe. Oh, yeah, I, I know, work, right? Work. I'll be fine. Which one of us is adding I'm her? trying. <laughs> huh? Which one of you is what? Making sure you're okay. I'm going to be fine. I promise. I just, I've got a lot of built up anxiety um, from work. I'm, I'm trying to work through it. I promise I'll be okay. Um, it just might take some time. Oh. I'm lucky because as soon as I don't work there anymore, the anxiety gone. No. Not See, even. The, the thing is, is like my work had. Um, thank you, potato. I love you too. Um, my work had some long-standing issues. Like now that I'm finally not there, I can talk about it. And let me tell you guys, just like straight fucking up, don't get frontier. Do not ever get Frontier if you have an option. I know sometimes they have closed markets. There's no other option, but they treat their people so fucking awful. I and I'm 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 trying to be better because uh, you know I'm not there anymore, so I really should be okay. Just whoa, God. Uh, just a lot happened all at once with them, so. Here. God, what is the speed? I, I, mm. Hello, Ashes. I don't think I've ever seen you in chat before. Hi, Ashes! Um, I think I've seen them before once or twice. Um, <laughs> you game? Uh, no. Actually, or I wasn't trying to. Dear God. Uh. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, I will be right back. I have to go. What is the speed? I don't know. I can't. Oh, oh God. Energizer, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> Oh. 
But yeah, um, just work caused me to basically stop talking to a lot of people and stop doing some things that I really need to do. Like, for instance, it's kind of gross, but showering was kind of a once every other week type of deal. Um, and just in the last, like, couple of days, I've started to try and do it more. Um, uh, basically, I would wake up, I would start streaming, or I, I, I'd go into work, I'd try to talk to my friends as much as possible, and couldn't always, just because work was back-to-back -back calls of constant screaming. Um, and then I would get off the phone and maybe pop into Al's Discord for like a couple of hours while I tried setting up stream. And then on the days that I wasn't working, I slept all day because that's how long it took. That That's how long it took. I basically slept and I was so depressed I couldn't do anything. So please, for the sake of maybe if we boycott them, their workers will find other jobs. Don't, don't get Frontier, please. They're not good to their customers. They're not good to their people. Um, it was a lot of bullshit. It was a lot of bullshit. All right. Yeah. Okay. That was, that was a couple days ago. Yeah. I think I remember that. Um, it feels like I, I'm just, you know, making excuses, but I'm trying to remind myself that no work was pretty much just a hellhole. Um, and that it's okay for me to kind of give myself the, the, the time to chill out from that, so... If for whatever reason I have to step away from stream over the next couple of weeks, I apologize. I'm going to try not to, but it will pretty much depend on what's going on in my life at that point. So, without further ado, I don't really want to talk about um, about that anymore. So, thank you. My light. And actually, I'm going to be ending my stream, but I will send oh, you Oh, I did guys... not realize you were still streaming. I will send you guys on with Lita. As for tomorrow, it is actually day night with Lita, and apparently we are playing Red Dead Redemption 2 online. Mm -hmm. so and then before be... that, I'm probably going to <laughs> hang out with some friends, because I just, I, I, I've got a lot of things that I need to actually start on now that I can maybe find the time to do them. And thank you. I, I appreciate I'm I'm trying. I'm trying. I promise. I am trying to take care of myself and in my opinion, more importantly, all my friends. And I know that some, pe some of you are going to complain about that, but I'm sorry, but to me, y'all are important. So... Glad you no longer work there. Thank you, Jemby. I'm I'm glad I don't work there anymore either. Cause I'm I just I miss being able to talk to people. I miss saying, Oh my god, I miss you, let's hang out, and then actually being able to hang out. I miss my cat complaining and asking me for attention, and instead of just having to shush him and tell him to go away, I can actually pick him up, put him in my lap, snuggle him. You know, I take a shower, eat at some place other than my desk, work out, swim, shit like that. Like, I just, I miss having time for things. I miss feeling like I can think, being able to remember shit beyond, oh, hey, this is how you make a billing adjustment. Just, uh, now I'm just complaining about work. I'm sorry. Let's change the topic to something more pleasant. But as I said... Tomorrow okay, is dinner night. with Lita, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for joining tonight, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I will send you on over to her now. Bye bye. Yeah, bye. Thank you. And I'm. I'll try. I'm like thank you. Um.